Hey, what's up, y'all? I know it's been a while since I've recorded a video, but hey, special circumstances. I had to come out of retirement, so here we are. It is the return of the Popeye's chicken sandwich, uh, or I should say the, the chicken sandwich Armageddon <laughs> that's going around town. It's crazy, so... Uh, last time the uh, chicken sandwich was out, it was probably back in August, and um, it it hit the internet like a storm. Like as soon as it hit the internet, everybody wanted it. There was fights breaking out. People were out there, you know, in lines for hours. So me and the wifey we decided, which she's gonna join me on this a little bit later on, but. I had to get this in while they're hot and fresh. So me and the wife, we decided to uh, do this together. Uh, we were going to try and test, taste these chicken sandwiches together back in August. But we were going to try and wait for the hype to slow down because we didn't want to go up there and wait a whole hour or two. So I went out of town for work for about two weeks at the end of the August, beginning of September. And when I get back, they're no longer selling these chicken sandwiches. So we're like, oh my God. So we signed up for the text message to let us know when they were going to be coming back. And they said it was going to be coming back mid-October. That never happened. So here we are, November, what was that, 3rd, yesterday. They're back. We didn't even get a message. Nobody knew it was back. We should, we find, we come home uh, after a long day out and find out they were back yesterday. So we're like, okay. I'm gonna. I, I got the day off today. I'm gonna go down there. I'm gonna wait, and I'm gonna get these chicken sandwiches today. So, I'll let you guys know this now. Unless you, this is definitely was a mission. Unless you got a day off, this is not a. I'm gonna run on my lunch time and go get this chicken sandwich type thing. I showed up there at 9 a.m. Because uh, I went yesterday around 8 p.m. And they told me, oh, they're sold out. They'll be open again at around uh, 10 a.m. Just come on through. Show up at 9 a.m. Figured I'll hang out in the car for a little bit. Maybe, you know, stand outside for the last 15 minutes before they open up. Around 9.50, a lot of people start showing up. We go line up at the door. They come out. They're like, oh, uh, our chicken is all frozen. We're not opening until 10. I mean, until, uh, first they said 10.30. Then they said 11. Then they said maybe 11, 11.30. And I'm like, all right, I'm, I've got the day off. I've already committed to this. So if you don't have the patience to wait, this is not for you. <laughs> um, so everybody that was there bust out. They left. They weren't there. You know, they weren't ready to wait that long. I was like, I'm chilling. Chilled out there for a minute. People came. People left. People came again. They left. So then finally, I, I had to move my car because... The drive through was just insane. Like, they were blocking traffic and stuff. And I was like, all right, let me um, move my car so that when I get my chicken sandwiches, I can get the flock out of there. Anyways, move the car. It's getting hot in the car, so I go stand by the door so everybody will start coming. This is around probably about 10, 35, 10, 40. I'm like, all right, so we're going to hang out here. So the line starts getting long, maybe about 20 people behind me. I'm the first one in line to get this chicken sandwich right here yes i already took a bite out because i wanted to get it while it was fresh i actually went and got six of them i got three spicy three originals i got me one spicy and one original because i want to see the difference between the two but the other four sandwiches i had to take from anaheim to norwalk to my wife and her co-workers being nice husband that I am so she got to she's already finished her sandwich so this is why I like, took a quick bite while I was there but anyways so I got the spicy Popeye's chicken sandwich but everybody's making their videos so of course I had to stop I had to break my boycott a lot of you know I've been on a boycott from Chick-fil-a because of their um their stance on gay rights and i have a gay brother and a gay best friend and uh i'm committed to you know their cause so i haven't had chick-fil-a since probably about 2012 and i love chick-fil-a sandwiches and their shakes but anyways that's besides the point this video is about these sandwiches so yeah i broke my boycott so i went ahead and got the spicy chicken sandwich from chick-fil-a uh, I'll tell you the difference between the two right now. The pop, and I'm gonna hurry up because my sandwiches is getting cold. And 
Granted, these sandwiches I got probably about an hour ago since I had to go across town and back. So when I came back, I stuck them in the oven. Okay? So I'm not getting it fresh from Popeye's. This is our old but reheated toasted in the oven. So the difference between the two, I'll tell you right now, Popeye's uh, spicy chicken sandwiches, it's a sauce that they put it on. Chick-fil-A's, the chicken is spicy, which it looks like it's just the sauces cooked into the chicken. Unfortunately, since I stuck it in the oven, the sauce is all melted into the bun. So that's that's one downside of not eating it fresh. So again, if you have the time to eat it, go there and eat it, eat it there, do so. But I'm going to tell you right now, you're going to have to have some patience with these folks. Um, even before the chicken sandwich revolution came about, I've heard that um, Popeye's isn't the best with their logistics and their personnel and stuff. Like, they're a chicken restaurant and they run out of chicken. So, I don't know how you can do that. But, you know, hey. Anyways, that's one of the reasons why I was first there because I went, like I said, I went last night and they were sold out. So, I'm going to, we're already six minutes into the video. Let's go ahead and get a try of this. So, I'll tell you right now, when I took a bite of this earlier, this thing was so damn juicy. The chicken is really crunchy. Um, the bread is toasted. Chick-fil-A's bread is not toasted. So, but in my case, the bo I took the top buns off of both of these to stick them in the oven. So the bottom bun on the Chick-fil-A is toasted now. So here we go. Like I said before, very juicy. I completely missed the pickle on that, so I'm going to grab. I'm gonna steal one of these pickles out of here. It's funny. I'll also note that I started talking to people in line, and it was a school teacher that was in line buying chicken sandwiches for her coworkers. And one of her coworkers was like, "I just want the chicken and the bun." I'm like. You waited this long to just get the chicken and the bun. This is an entire experience, okay? If you just wanted the chicken and the bun, you should have went down there when they was doing the bring your own bun and just had the chicken. But anyway, another reason why I bring that up is because, like I said, Popeye's chicken sandwich, they're spicy. It's in the sauce. Well, this woman was like, I want the spicy one, but I don't want any sauce. Sorry, honey. You... you Anyways, very, very good. Very juicy. Still very crunchy. Again, I stuck it in the oven, but when I took a bite of it earlier, it was crunchy, so we'll give them that much. Now, Chick-fil-A. Let's give this guy a bite here. Now, Chick-fil-A doesn't have any sauce on there. So no sauce whatsoever. Two pickles. So I got to make sure that I bite it from the pickle side. Okay. So here we go. Hmm. That's surprisingly good. That's better than I've tasted it in the past. More spice to it, too. Like I said, the sauce on mine melted. And they might not have put that much sauce on the Popeye's one because I was the first one in line. So they was already under the gun. They had a line of people. So they just kind of like slapped mine together. Boom. Took me 15 minutes to get this one at Popeye's. Maybe 16 minutes. Took me 8 minutes to get this one over at Chick-fil-A. God damn. I really thought I was going to be pulling more towards the Popeye's one. This one is really... If you like spice, this one is the one. If you like juicy chicken, Popeye's is the one. So Chick-fil-A definitely got the spice down. And again, I've, I've probably messed up the original taste of this by sticking them both in the oven. But the Chick-fil-A one is now crunchy too. It's crispy. I didn't put the top bun in, but... I 
I like their pickles better too. So I'm ready. Something else I saw. Like I said, me and my wife, we have been watching a lot of these Taster's Choice videos. Kev on stage. I loved his that he did. Um, a lot of Instagram and YouTubers did it. What Kev on stage was saying is you got to put the Chick-fil-A sauce on it. I feel like that's cheating because the original recipe is the original recipe. But if I got to add sauce to it. All right. But let me try this one again. I got to say, man, they kind of neck and neck right now for me. The chicken is much better. The chicken is much better on the Popeyes. We're going to get Amber's opinion on this. But let me let me try this with I gotta eat a, a knife real quick. Let me try this with the Chick Fil A sauce. Oh, by the way, my Bills won another game, so that's why I'm wearing my shirt today. Right now, they are I believe they are two and seven. So we are doing it this year. All right, I only use a little bit of sauce. I'm not like Heavy on the sauce. Yeah, this is their Chick-fil-A sauce. I know they have different types of sauce. Like I said, I'm not really a big Chick-fil-A eater just because my personal opinion, my personal, um, I don't know, stance. But here we go. Yeah, their Chick-fil-A sauce is like a honey mustard. Okay. I know this is way more than y'all want to see and y'all want to hear, but that's 12 minutes of me eating chicken sandwiches. <laughs> You'll hear from my wife later on. In a few minutes, I'm going to probably just switch over to a double shot. But, um, God damn. I really think it, I really thought it was going to be like unanimous on the Popeye, like, but... I'm going to have to say they even. I'm just going to have to say it. I'm going to have to say they even. As biased as I want it to be. And again, like I said, this just might be because of what I did. Sticking them in the oven and kind of like revitalizing them. But yeah, they're even. Popeye's definitely more chicken. Juicy. Boom. Crunchy. Chick-fil-A, definitely a little bit more flavor, more spice. And that's before I put the sauce on it. Once I put the sauce on it, it's just like, yeah. All right. Well, anyways, that's it. Love you guys. Uh, try it for yourself. It is definitely a must try. Do it on your day off. <laughs> Don't sit up there and try and run on your lunch break. Don't wait till you get off of work and be like, I'm going to just go swing by Popeye's because they're going to be sold out. And it's going to be like that for a while. So, Anyways, this is your boy Henry, Hank, H, whatever you think. Let me know. Peace.